Business English Idioms with Dylan from British English Coach. And this idiom is to take the bull by the horns. So here's an example sentence. She's very good at her job, but the other members of the team can't work with her. Well, you're just going to have to take the bull by the horns and fire her. So this expression, to take the bull by the horns, what does it mean? Does it mean A, to be brave and deal with the problem directly? Or B, to resolve a problem by taking an aggressive action? Or C, to get rid of a difficult employee by firing them? So let's go back to the example. She's very good at a job, but the other members of the team can't work with her. You're just going to have to take the ball by the horns and fire her. Does that mean A, B, or C? And the answer is A. If you take the ball by the horns, you're brave and you deal with the problem directly. You face it directly. So a couple of questions for you. What do you think? Is the ability to take the bull by the horns a feature of effective management or effective managers? And the other question, how comfortable are you with taking the bull by the horns? Okay, let's have a look at a sentence. You can tell me if it's correct or incorrect. The company was losing too much money the CEO had to take the ball by the horns and get rid of 50 employees. But taking this action saved the company. Is that correct or incorrect? It's correct. The company was losing too much money. The CEO had to take the ball by the horns and get rid of 50 employees. And this action saved the company. That was a very brave and a very direct action. He faced the problem head on, like a bullfighter facing a bull, which is where the idiom comes from. So that was another business English idiom from Dylan at BritishEnglishCoach.com. Bye for now.